in this chapter, I want to show you how you can install a web server on the Linux virtual machine by installing the tool or the software component of Nginx. So this is a web server. So if you want to install it on this particular Linux machine, what you can do is we first need to update the package index. So this is a Linux command. So remember, we are executing these commands on our remote as your Linux machine. Then I'll just clear the screen. Next, I can install the tool of Nginx. So it's an app, get sorry, install Nginx. Just put Y to continue. So it's installing the Nginx component. This is a web server. This also listens on port 80. Once this is done, if I now take the public IP address, if I go on to a new tab, so I can see the Nginx web server homepage. Now we can also install the Nginx package via cloud init. So this is a standard that is available for installing packages on Linux based machines. So cloud init is available for Linux based machines and you can also have it in place when you create an Azure virtual machine based on a Linux operating system. So now I want to use cloud init to install the Nginx package via Terraform. Now, we need to do this during the creation of the Azure VM itself. So before that, here, let me exit from the session on our Linux VM. So we are back in our temp folder. Now, let me do a Terraform destroy to delete the resources because we want to create the Azure Linux VM again, but this time make use of the cloud init configuration. This will ensure to install Nginx during the creation of the virtual machine itself. Now, once this is done, let me close the terminal. Now let's add the code onto our current configuration file to install the Nginx component via the cloud init configuration. So here before the resource, I'm gonna add a data block. This allows us to use a cloud init configuration. Yeah, the only thing I'm doing is to mention the Nginx package that needs to be installed. And then if I go on to my Linux VM itself for this resource, yeah, I need to now choose custom data. I need to now choose data dot template cloud in it. That's what we have. And I need to choose the option of vendor. So this will ensure that whatever packages, so this will ensure that the cloud init configuration is applied onto the custom data. So custom data is where we can actually have the cloud init configuration in place. So let me save this. Let me go on terminal. Let's clear this. Let's create a plan. So there seems to be an inconsistent dependency. So the plan is in place. Now let's apply it. And let's wait till this is complete. Once this is complete, we can actually verify. Let's go on to the all resources here. Let's go on to our new Linux VM. Take the public IP address, go on to new tab, and we can see the Nginx homepage. So during the creation of the Linux VM itself, we were able to install the Nginx package.